All right, to solve this inequality, what we're going to do is distribute the 1 6th and the negative 1 4th. Let's just do it one at a time, though. So a negative 1, I apologize, 1 6th times 18 would be a 3, and that's a y, plus 1 6th times 12 is 2, and this is less than a negative 1 4th times 24y is a negative 6y, and a negative 1 4th times negative 20 is a positive 5 right here. So now we're going to just solve this as though it were a regular equation. And I'm going to put my y's on the left so that I don't have any negative coefficients. So we don't have to worry about flipping the signs by multiplying or dividing both sides by negative. So I need to get this negative 6y to the other side of the inequality by adding 6y to both sides. I also need to subtract 2 from both sides because this plus 2 is on the wrong side of the inequality as well. Now I didn't have to flip the sign because we didn't multiply or divide by any negatives. So I've got a 9y, this is 0, this is 0, and 5 minus 2 is 3. So to solve for y, I would divide both sides by, I put 3, I meant 9. Divide both sides by 9, and we see that y is less than 1 third. That's all we got to do on this one, because it didn't actually ask us to graph, even though we could do that.